Okay, uh, go ahead. Draft, uh, draft day three. Fourth round has happened wild and fast. Uh, I couldn't even get going on the <laughs> on something for the first pick. Uh, Vikings snatched. Uh, I have no idea how to say his name. I think it's Kane Wangwu. Do not, do not quote me on that. Um, he's a running back out of uh, out of uh, Iowa State, a Cyclone. Um, I did not expect a running back, certainly not this early. I thought maybe they would take a running back in the draft. It like wouldn't shock me because we let Boone go, and you know we don't really have. I mean, we did sign, re-sign Amir Abdullah, but that you know to a very low uh, risk deal. Um, and uh, so we, you know, we can always use a, you know, can always use a good running back because you know, Cooks had injury issues and even Madison has. So um, I know very little about him. Supposedly he's very fast, so maybe he, maybe he'll be, maybe he can be kind of a return guy. If he is, then Amir Abdul is gone. <laughs> like they're, they're not gonna they're not gonna be keeping two guys like that. Um, so. But we got our next pick coming up here. Uh, we're waiting on Washington. They're not really announcing them now today, because they're, you know, that's usually how day three goes. They don't really, they don't stop everything to announce the picks. So you just gotta have a have an eagle eye and see the see the banner. <laughs> um, we got Washington picking just now, and then it'll be our turn. Um, so we got two picks left in the fourth, and then three more today. We got it, what, uh, two fifths and a sixth. So no sevenths. You know Rick doesn't like that he doesn't have a seventh. He's going to do something about that. Um, but, uh, so yeah, I mean, yeah, if the, I mean, if this is, if the running back we took is, is certainly useful, that's not, that's not a bad pick. That's not a bad spot to draft a running back. Um, I feel like we don't have quite the, the need at, at offensive line now because I feel like we've gotten two starters. We have we have starters. And look at that, they went. Are you fucking kidding me? They went to fucking commercial right before the pick. And this is one where they're not even announcing it. So we're the, you know, god damn these. I swear to God, it is personal. I don't even know which one I have on right now. I think I got on. <laughs> it's ridiculous that they do this to us every time, every fucking time. All right, NFL Network is not a commercial. I swear to God, man. Oh, these <laughs> these commercials are the one we're about to pick every time. That's. I think this is going to be what our uh, what our sixth pick of the draft. I swear they're going to commercial like right right at four of them. Unbelievable. But, uh, so, you know, our remaining picks, I think, oh, well, never mind, here we go, pick is in. It's like Rick! pick in the fourth round, the Minnesota Vikings select Cameron Bynum. Safety from the University of California. Cameron Bynum is a big corner, and one of the things I want to say about this kid, because when you talk to the coaches, you talk to people at Cal, before we even get into the football player... Well, right, there you go. Zimmer's got his corner. ...about how great of a kid this guy is. I mean, <laughs> unbelievable character. They went on and on and just... They, they must really like him if, if, if uh, Slick Rick himself announces the pick. Uh, when he's up in press coverage, he needs to do a little bit job, a better job of throwing his hands, getting his hands on people. But he's a pretty fluid athlete. He's smooth. Hey. Uh, I liked him a little He'll bit. play if he'll play. You know. He improve with those hands. We'll and I thought the effort was outstanding in tackling, Charles. The effort was there, but there's times where he falls off a little bit. And notice they announced him as safety, yeah. yep. which signified Anthony Harris no longer there to yeah. be there with uh, Yeah, so, so they say he's a corner, but he's all, so they, said, they did say safety. We'll see. I mean, I think we have more of a need. Long term, we have more of a need at... Uh, well, I don't know. I, I suppose we could you'd say long term we have equal need both places, but obviously a lot of that depends on what happens with Gladney. But uh, hey, we knew we were taking a corner <laughs> at some point. 
So there we go, there's our corner, and we're picking again here in like 10 picks. We'll see if I get that one. Um, but, uh, so yeah. <laughs> We've hit, we've hit all the, we've at least drafted someone in all the, the big need spots, really, except for probably wide receiver, and I don't know how big a, a need they feel receiver is, but I would not be shocked if the next pick is a receiver.